we're gonna be going to a different thrift store today and I'm only gonna get something if it's a 50% plus sell through rate and if I have a really good feeling about it and also if there's like some Christmassy stuff maybe it is so cold which is great I love the cold I have to go send out I think I have six packages so I'm gonna go do that and then hit the thrift store okay so we're going into the thrift store another voiceover uh, this was the place I had the fill a bag sale so it's filled with new stuff you see that little bell in there we'll come back to that these look like old ornament I mean lights and then these were magnets I ended up getting let's see Oh yes, this little Santa guy, he didn't have um, any markings on him and he was a little rough, like most of the stuff. Okay, I'm setting down the basket so I can show you guys. I found this Tiffany & Co. bell and it's so pretty and it was only a dollar. I have it listed right now. I'm very excited about it. It's a beautiful piece. Um, oh, a little holly glass, little frosted um, treat glasses, dishes. What else did we have? Oh yeah, I was checking on this because sometimes um, the perfume can go for a decent amount, or the cologne. Um, I'm looking at this milk glass, nothing special. That Avon Moonwind was not worth anything <laughs> in my condition at all. Oh yeah, I picked this up because it was like an amber color. And at this point, I am fighting. <laughs> I'm getting freaked out just watching. Um, they balance stuff up against the back, like plates and stuff. And then when I'm looking at the stuff in the front and it starts sliding and I get so anxious. I love looking at these things. Most of the time they're not worth anything and like 99% of the time there's chipping and there's a whole rose missing off of that. A milk glass little wine goblet, not worth anything. This one was real dirty inside too. What else do we have? Oh, some of these... Um, candle toppers I found out can actually go for decent money that one I didn't really that one was chipped anyway so I didn't look that one up cute little sunflower cup part of a little little tea set maybe piggies what's that it looks like a syrup thing this is the aroma therapy thing these can be cool I think if you have them in like twos or more cool <clears throat> Joy, I have a couple of things in that brand. My little coconut cup I found. Now I was looking through the frames, which I do on and off. Um, Mary Inglebright does pretty good for me, and I found this little frame. I thought it was adorable, so I got it. I think it yeah, 1997. That print was very pretty. It wasn't worth anything, but the sunflowers remind me of a friend I used to have. So I really liked that, but I didn't get it. I ended up leaving it. That one was really cool too, but again, left it. A little decoupage maybe. Ooh, some stained glass paper in that one. <laughs> Love, laughter, and I don't know. Just thumbing through some frames. I ended up looking that up before, and that's like the third time I've looked at it, and I keep forgetting. These were cute. I would never try and ship something like that though. They weren't worth anything anyways. Now this caught my eye, okay. I kept looking at it just because I liked the way um, it looked textured, I guess. I don't know if it's sponge wear maybe. This I ended up getting to do more research on. Because I do that a lot, but that one was very interesting to me. Oh yeah, I'd already looked at those. I was scanning through. A lot of this stuff I've looked up before. It's just old stuff that they have. This was pretty cool. It was melted in though and I didn't have two so again. And here we are again back at this piece. I love the colors on it. I ended up getting it just because to like check. <laughs> this I thought was interesting but I didn't get that. I do however end up getting that box on the side that I don't think I show but it's thrash so I don't show it again 
again so the thrift store i went to i was filming in there but there it was so busy today on a friday and it doesn't make sense because where it's located it's like i don't know it's just never <laughs> maple's looking at me it's just never that busy unless they're having like the fill a bag sale and it was just a bunch of like a bunch of people like groups of like four and five and it's not a big thrift store like some aisles you can have two people on and then the other ones it's one person only but yeah i found a lot of cool stuff ain't gonna lie say hi chi chi yeah good boy